Here's the Philadelphia trifecta, the Liberty Bell, cheese steaks, and you're right, soft pretzels. Well, we know where to find the best. The Sanson Street Pretzel Factory is this week's food find. So I really am in a pretzel factory. 100%. I've never been in one. This is great. I'm going to get to see the pretzels exactly made. Exactly how we make it. This is the flour we use. The first thing we do is we throw the flour into the mixer. Mix it up for about seven or eight minutes. So here we go. Okay. You stand here, and I'll stand here. Okay, and I will learn from the master. Try. Oh, okay. Ready? Now grab a string. Now you're going to hold it open like this. Okay. And you're going to try to do a little loop. <laughs> hey, I wasn't it a looks, Boy Scouts. It looks a lot harder than it is. Oh, my goodness. Yes, it does. Grab it. All right. You're going to do a little flip. <laughs> Almost. Just Almost like only cats and horseshoes and hand grenades, though, right? OK. Nice and easy. And then, right? Hold it over. Then. That's good. Now you have your knots. And then? Pick up your knots. And they go here? They go right there. But, oh, wait a minute. I did it upside wow. down, didn't I? I think you did a little bit too much twist action. Ah, oh, too much. I didn't think there was such a thing as too much twist action. You ready? Okay, one. Easy. Let's do it in sync, right? That's good. And You're there. And then I've got this. And Flip then it one. over. See, that's the part I'm There you go. Forget that step. Thank you. All right. Now, now lift from up here, the knots. Small knots. See, it's an art, isn't it? So it is. It's, it's practice. It's easier said than done. That's all. Now, how long did it take you to get so good at this? It took me probably action. about seven or eight days. <laughs> That's all? Every day doing it for a you few hours You look like you've been doing it for uh, seven or eight years. When you fill up that tray, which you're going to do in about uh, three seconds, <laughs> we're going to bake them. All right. Well, do you want to make the pretzel hot dog first? Well, Show sure. Show you how to do that? Sure. Because that's what I want to eat. Didn't you say you still eat one I of these every day? I still eat one of them every day. You haven't burned out on them? No. All Never right. will. Let's They're the best it, thing Yeah, the, they look good. First thing we're doing, we're going to grab a string. Like the ones we made from the, the pretzels. The exact same, same ones that we okay. twisted with the pretzels. We're going to roll it out a little bit. All right. And here's my string. OK. And you need a pretzel hot dog or a pretzel I, I or need a hot dog. And then what kind of cheese is that? It's American cheese. Good old American cheese here and in Philadelphia, grab, right? Beautiful. All right. So, so what we're going to do is you grab the hot dog. Mm, I hope I'm better at this than the twisting. Then you're just going to roll this out. Oh, to flatten it, on, okay. Just to flatten it a little bit, give it a little Down bit of moisture. Down at this end, or? Yeah, that's up perfect. To the, okay, now what? Now you flip it. Wait a minute, wait, 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 wait. What flip did you, the, you flip flipped the string it to over. twist it? Just, yeah, just flip it over. Like that? Yep. Now you're going to okay. put the cheese around the hot dog like this. Okay. And then you're going to wrap it up really, really I mean, tight. Why does your cheese look so much bigger than mine? That's, I don't know. I don't have the touch, okay. Just hold it tight. I keep telling myself that they're all going to taste the same. They're, they're, believe me, these things are unbelievable. I guess so, if you eat them every day. So okay. Just wrap it. Then it's almost like a pig in a blanket. Yum. You want to cover all the cheese so it doesn't leak out when we bake them up. Oh, OK. So I need to put more dough and cover up the cheese. Yeah, but you want to go over towards. Because I'm going start. to cover this end. Exactly. Okay. All so right. you start at the very beginning. So you're half on the hot dog, mm -hmm. half on the cheese. Mm -hmm. And then just wrap it really tight. Oh, wait a minute. Why was mine not getting covered? Got to pull it really, really, and just put it on an angle. There you so go. So it covers this end. So it covers that end. All right. I'm a copycat. Monkey see, monkey do. I know, mine is scary, but. No, actually, that's going to be nice and doughy. And you're nice you can, you can and a, you're a good liar. Thank you. <laughs> nice and that's doughy. That's not a good, good trait. <laughs> there, see? Yours looks just like mine. Oh, OK. And now? The baking process. Now the baking process. All right. So you're dipping them in the candy soda. And how many are you doing at a time? Like 10? Only 10 at a time. OK, yeah. 10 at a time. And you're just dipping them in like a second. That's all. Just a second. All right. Salt them up real good. And then he puts them in the oven. Puts fires them, the them oven. up, right? Puts them in the oven for seven minutes. Seven minutes, you said. All right. Here we go. They're ready. Voila! Oh, they look so great. They smell. Hot pretzel. Mm, Just came nothing out. Nothing like it. Hot out of the oven. Um, where, where's my pretzels, by the way? Are they? They're coming up next, actually. Oh. 
put these aside. Can't wait to see that. So we can see yours. <laughs> Okay. See, well, they don't right, look too they're not bad. bad, bad. I told you. I don't have that twisting action like you do. You have two mustards. You have the, the spicy standard and then uh, yellow, and the yellow. mustard. The spicy is definitely uh, the big seller. Is Everybody it? loves really? the spicy. Okay, more than the traditional though. yellow. Oh. Definitely, it's a Philadelphia mm. thing. Wow. Definitely, look uh, at the cheese oozing out of those. They, they are wonderful. Great. You want to let oh. them cool down maybe two, three minutes because okay. they are extremely hot. And then I can have but, dinner. Uh, and then you can have dinner. Nice snack. Is this the one I made? Yes, that's yours. I'm not ashamed. So is that it, Michael? Actually, we have a little surprise for you. Look at that! The review, CNA. I went to the Carol Merrill School. That looks great. You think, thank you so much. Thank you. Blue's a spot where you can dine twice a week and enjoy two totally different meals. Stay tuned, there's more coming up.